I mean, it's mad when you think about it. We were just some chancers who started a radio show. We'd all come out of the student movement. I actually didn't like Aaron when I first met him. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. We had protested uh, against tuition fees. We'd occupied universities. We had, if you remember, we had been charged down by police on horseback in that freezing square and we lost. But a lot of us knew, I think, um, that there was this huge gap between the status quo and the future. But I think what we probably both agreed on was that we weren't represented much by the mainstream media or really by any political party. And, and that it was time for us to transform it ourselves, right? And, and that this was the time to have those big ideas and be talking about those big ideas and that they should come from us, from all of us. I think if there's a moment when Navarro became Navarro, it was in 2015 when we interviewed Jeremy Corbyn and the leadership election. And it was the day that his odds were cut. He became hmm. the favorite. And there was almost a moment before that interview where I sat down and I thought, wow, this guy could be the Labour leader. And that meant that that brand of politics was very relevant, but also that our suspicions were right. And that actually Navarro Media was on the cusp of something very, very, very important. We're at a political tipping point, right? All the old assumptions are falling away. Another world is coming. And the question is, what's it gonna look like? Neoliberalism's dying, in it? And Navarra Media started, what, five years ago? But it's really in the last two years we've started making a real difference. Yeah, I mean, the, the sky's the limit. And, you know, so far we've been doing it all on a shoestring. I mean, I think people don't know, but all our contributors are paid, but the overwhelming majority of the core team are purely volunteers and that has to change and that's why we're asking you to donate just one hour's worth of your monthly wage and we will keep working round the clock to build a new media for a different politics